This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete Haynes online manual at haynes.com. Fully apply the handbrake. Open the passenger's door and pull the bonnet release handle. Lift the bonnet slightly, then pull the safety catch lever and fully open the bonnet. Unclip the safety prop from the slam panel and engage the end with the holes on the bonnet underside. With the engine completely cold, unscrew the filler cap from the coolant expansion tank. Place chocks each side of the rear wheels. Position the jack head under the front subframe rear mounting, then raise the vehicle until the wheel is clear of the ground. Support the vehicle with an axle stand under the reinforced section of the sill flange. Undo the screws securing the plastic tray beneath the radiator location. Then prise out the centre pins and remove the plastic expansion rivets. Remove the radiator under tray. Position a suitable container under the left hand end of the radiator. Unscrew the radiator drain tap and allow the coolant to drain into the container. When the coolant has finished draining, Close the drain tap. Mop up any spilled coolant. Withdraw the container from beneath the vehicle. Maneuver the under tray into position, then secure it with the various screws and rivets. Press in the rivet centre pins to secure them. Raise the vehicle and remove the axle stand. Using a funnel to reduce spillage, add a 50-50 mixture of the correct antifreeze and water to the expansion tank to bring the level up to the base of the tank filler neck. With the engine cool, check and if necessary top up the coolant level. Detach the end of the prop from the bonnet and clip it into place on the slam panel. Close the bonnet firmly and check it's secure.